Hey fam, thank you so much for joining me today. So you guys, I have an awesome guest. You know, all my guests are awesome on our show here at Life Inspired with Mo. And today, you guys, we have Janita Flowers from Janita's Jar, which is this amazing cookie company. So Janita, thank you so much for joining us today. How are you today? I am good. It's so good to see you. It's been so long since we've I know. Yes, thank you for being here today. So we're going to jump right in. I would love for my audience to get to know you already. So tell us about Janita's Jar and kind of what inspired you to create Janita's Jar. So I'll let you have the floor. Sure. So Janita's Jar, we are a mission-driven cookie company, and it's all about creating conversations to educate and eliminate relationship violence against women. And so what does that mean? Um, we are a for-profit cookie company. Um, we have these deliciously wholesome, crisp little bite-sized cookies in three flavors, chocolate chip, oatmeal peanut butter, chocolate chip, and oatmeal raisin. And But we, we are building upon the tradition of food being that tool to bring people together. And so I'm using food, specifically our cookies, to bring students together, college students, to talk about relationship violence. And the goal really is to reduce the shame that victims and survivors of relationship violence experience. And then also to bring young people together to realize we are responsible for each other. So if we see something, we say Absolutely. something, we do something, we take action. And then thirdly, after we're done with our conversation, after you've had the opportunity to think about the information, I want to inspire them to take action so that together we can change the stats, ultimately putting it into relationship violence against women. So that's what Janita's Jar is all about. So yes, we're a cookie company, but we're a social enterprise. We want to yes. use our cookies um, to do good, to bring good into the world. You know, most companies and organizations, they do have a pillar of social justice or community relation, but I like um, what you were saying that um, Janita's Jar actually came out of really uh, being created to support this instead of the other way around. Like, And the stats are one in four women will experience relationship violence at some point in her lifetime. So we need wow. to normalize these conversations about what's healthy in a relationship. How do we create boundaries in a relationship? And at the same time, men are in this as well. And it's up to men to really begin to have the conversations with other men because more than likely the abuser happens to be a male, but we want men to let other men know that that's not appropriate. It's not acceptable and how to create healthy boundaries, how to be healthy in a relationship yeah. so and creating those conversations, both with women and with men, um, because it's all yeah. of our responsibility to put an end to relationship violence. Yes, that's a good point. It's all of our responsibility. I like how you said that. So, um, you know. um, I want to jump right into to these delicious cookies. So you guys, if you have not had an opportunity, I'll show you how to get the cookies by the end of our segment here, but they are delicious. I have tried every one of them. I've had the privilege of trying them all. They are delicious. So are there any new things that we can expect, whether there are new products or something new that uh, Janita's Jar is on the brink of doing? What's going yeah. on? Yeah, so we launched in July of 2018, and it's been two years of educating and raising awareness about our product and our mission. And so in 2021, we're really excited that that's when we're going to begin to enter the grocery retail market. So right now you can just find us online, but soon you'll find us in grocery retails. But with that launch, mm -hmm. we are unveiling a brand new logo, um, new packaging design, in infusing our messaging in within our packaging even more than we were initially. Um, so I'm really excited about that. So they'll be able to watch our website and find out all the details and dates as um, all of those things approach and get closer. Got it. So I'm excited to come along and see those changes. So I'll be logging on as well to just check that out um, and all those things. And we're excited that, you know, even people who are seeing you for the first time and hearing about these wonderful cookies for the first time, I'm just so super excited that, you know, they'll be able to go to your website at first, but that we'll be able to see you in stores and I can just go grab yeah. my cookies while I'm grocery shopping. That's going to be so exciting. <laughs> yes. <I> can't wait. <laughs> but so just um, maybe expressing to the audience and giving them maybe some advice about being the best them they could possibly be where they are. You know, Janita's Jar is all about spreading a message of hope. Mm -hmm. um, 
ultimately so that we can live our best life. And when we think, think about, when I think about a cookie company, I mean, there's a gazillion cookie companies out there. And then when, if there's not a cookie company, people are making them in their home, but yeah. nobody can do what I do the way that I do it. And that's true for every one of us. And so we can't be intimidated or, or even stop ourselves. Take a yeah. chance on yourself and just launch it, do it, be it. The yes. world needs what we have to offer. Now it is time for you to take a chance on you. Yeah. So I'm going to leave that as our closing word because I think that is awesome. Janita, thank you so much for your time today. I so appreciate it. You guys stay tuned at the end. You will see some information about how you can um, get Janita's jar, her cookies for the meantime until we see them in stores. I'm super excited for her. And so thanks again for being with Hello us here. today. And we'll be looking out for those cookies. Thank you, Janita. Thank you. It's been great to be here. Thank you.